Now, ultrasound has certain specific properties and use cases because of those properties. The first property is that it has very high energy because it has a high frequency. And number two, it has a small wavelength. These waves have a very small wavelength because of which they tend to travel in a straight line. They don't bend around obstacles. Now, these two properties make ultrasound or ultrasonic waves very useful. For example, bats use these waves in order to detect obstacles in their paths because they send out ultrasonic waves or ultra free sound of high frequency which hits an obstacle and comes back and they can detect where this obstacle is based on the time it takes for the wave to come back. Uh, the same principle is also used in sonars in ships and submarines where, which give off ultrasound and then the sound goes hits, so let's say the ocean floor and comes back. And based on the time taken, you can calculate and you can also see the layout of the land or the layout of the ocean floor. Uh, they are also used to detect defects in walls and metals, etc. For example, cracks, uh, so on and so forth, because they can again hit the crack and they can bounce back. Uh, they are also used in medicine very frequently. You would have heard of ultrasonography right? or ultrasound scans. Again, it's based on the same principle. These, wa these waves are sent, it hits the organs of a patient and then it comes back and based on that, they create a picture of the internal organs. They're also used in surgeries to you know, help uh, break down kidney stones, for example. To keep learning with such engaging videos, download Baiju's, the learning app today.